गुड इवनिंग वेलकम टू डॉट प्रोग्रामिंग डॉट ब्लॉग स्पॉट डॉट कॉम दिस इज माई ब्लॉग टूडे आई विल शो यू हाउ टू क्रिएट ए रेडियो बटन लिस्ट इन ए एस पी डॉट नेट कॉल एंड ऑल्सो गेट द सेलेक्टेड वैल्यू फ्रॉम रेडियो बटन लिस्ट इन ए एस पी डॉट नेट कॉल वी हैव ए रेडियो बटन एक्चुअली आई विल क्रिएट ए रेडियो बटन यूजिंग द टैग हेल्पर and uh, also i will take a label control and the hidden field control in the view section the main logic is a uh, use a view model in this tutorial so first of all create a model in which uh, create a category class in it we have two property that is category id and the category name after that we will create a view model class that class hold the list of the category and also take uh, another value and after that i will take the selected value in a view model property okay so take another class in a new view model now the logic is first to get the list of the category in a controller section and after that that list provide to the view model and the radio button list actually designed uh, with the view model class because the view model class hold a, a list of categories so after that i will create a list of uh, category okay now in the controller section first to add a new controller so a dot net framework or you can say asp dot net core framework provide a text file it's related to the controller that's which uh, files are required to add in a asp dot net core that's in a startup file it's a simple concept provided by dot uh, net framework for the learning purpose now again click on the controller and add a new controller that is empty controller okay now in an index action method first add a list of the category and add some categories in the list okay and that list provided to the view model and generate a view in the basis of the view model it's a simple scenario because a view model class have a list type property so we easily create a list of radio buttons now add some categories in the list like electronics electrical computer and mechanical after doing this add a object of the view model class that is category model c 
3m equals to new category model and that class hold a list of categories so provide the C list object to the CM that is category model and another property that is select selected answers is empty now add a view in a view section hold empty we all know that in a view section we have a modal object create a modal in a declaration section of the directive add direct modal that is I want to use category view model add a new form and ASP action is index that is post type method and use a for loop and that loop run until the category finish okay now in the for loop section create a radio button control with the using tag helper it's a label control as well as hidden field control first two the type is a radio button and ASP4 is select answer and the value is at the rate model dot a list of category of I dot ID because list category is a hold another category object so category is hold ID and the name so list of category dot I dot ID in a category section that is ID again take a label control this is label and the input type is hidden field ASP4 is uh, belong to the category ID input type is submit and value is also submit in the cat controller create a post index method in uh, in this method we have a model and ASP4 is referred to the select item so selected item we have get the index number written a model 
redirect to action and action is thanks a newly generated action method and pass it here is m1 create a new action method that is thanks category model is also m1 and return to the view section view okay that's fine now build oops getting some error it's related to parenthesis or it's related to semicolon error first to check the parenthesis oops then blocks are one more required that is deleted by me yeah the semicolon error so now thank you thank you very much for watching this video please keep watching my all other video tutorials which is related to ASP.NET MVC and I will provide you uh, that concept in ASP.NET Core also Okay, so generate a view and simple get the view model dot selected answer uh, property from the model because uh, that thanks action method written the model that is view model so so same uh, directive from the view sections and paste it here and simple add selected value selected item now please keep watching my all other video tutorials which is related to ASP.NET Core ASP.NET MVC and please subscribe my channel if you like it and I will show uh, I will provide you best video tutorial which is related to ASP.NET Core I promise you I will provide but remember first to subscribe my channel then I'll, I will provide you so please subscribe and getting your result thank you thank you very much again let's see your uh, output mm, yeah we have some categories electronics electrical computer and mechanical and select one from the given categories and click to submit button suppose I select electronics then uh, result will be one, 1 and electrical is 2 your selected value is 2 so thank you thank you very much again